here comes Santa Claus, here comes Santa Claus. Hey, there he is. There's old Saint Nick. Yeah, you wanna know what I want for Christmas? A rise of fame to Hollywood. <laughs> you know what I'm saying. What's up everybody, Dan the Man in the house. I wanna welcome you back to Dan the Man's Weekly. Today is Friday, December 19th, 2014. And we're about six days away to we're about six days to wait until fa la 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 if you know what I mean. <laughs> okay. Alright guys, we're gonna get to uh maybe the back to you right there. Uh, here's fine. Alright guys, we're gonna get to the Dirty River Boys in a second, but first, wait a second. <laughs> Just wanna make sure I'm still recording. Uh, is that Shirley Staring? And a Oh, it is Shirley Staring. <laughs> Alright. Okay, all right, we'll get to the bottom of this. Um, yeah, as uh, for, I just want to say uh, a good luck to UTEP, so uh, to UTEP football tomorrow as they as they go into the Gilded New Mexican Bowl, New Mexico Bowl in Albuquerque against uh, UTEP, uh, Utah State. So, good luck to the Miners. Go Miners. Yep. And the Cowboys, they're like ten and they're like ten and four. Let's hope they still, let's hope they keep the playoffs. So. Go, pack, go Cowboys, and uh, yeah, sorry about that, I hate when that happens, alright, sorry, alright, this fell off, <laughs> I when that happens, alright, anyway, um, anyway, I have a, I have a couple of few things on Impact Wrestling, since uh, I'm already watching the TNA Greatest Moments, I already saw the first half, which was, uh, I already saw the first half, which was, uh, Part, part one last Wednesday, and this coming Wednesday, which will be Christmas Eve, which will be um, the part two of the TNA's Greatest Moments, which would be uh, the last and final episode that will be aired on Spy TV, and before um, before they move it to Destination America, which uh, which will be um, hold on a second. I noticed that. Um, which will be, I know it's January, yeah, and, um, yeah, it will be, um, yeah, it will be, uh, the first year, it will be Wednesday, January 7th, and, uh, yeah, on 2015, this will be, uh, the first, that will be firstly aired, uh, on Destination America, can't wait for Impact Wrestling, and, uh, I'll show you the, I'll show, uh, if possible, I'll show you the logo for the next for the next Impact Wrestling. So all you Impact Wrestling fans out there, yeah, can't wait. Oh, and um, there's some greatest moments uh, I like to read down uh, of TNA's of M TNA Impact Wrestling's greatest moments. Okay, yeah, there was uh, besides the main birth of the main event Mafia was back in 2008. I remember. Yeah, man. But who can I forget that? But the good thing is, it's a good thing Sting brought back the main event Mafia with Kurt Angle, Samoa Joe, and Magnus. They were going, they were going against the Aces and Eights. Damn them to hell. And good thing is, well, since um, since they did it, since um, it was main event Mafia versus the Aces and Eights back in two thousand back last year. But thank God, Aces and Eights ended. Uh, Ended uh, last year, November, after 18 months of terror. Thank, thank God. <laughs> Man, I had a nightmare that the Ace and the Eights were taking over, uh, took over. Um, oh, that's a long story. But I'll explain about that later. Well, yeah. Again, main event Mafia versus the Aces and Eights back last year, 2013. <laughs> Good thing. And another moment that that TNA uh, aired on Spike TV. It's been all been all over nine years now. And I don't know what's gonna happen, so we'll have to wait and see on Destination America. So we'll have to wait and see. And give me a second. Yeah, I just want to make sure I'm still recording. So, and the another greatest moment that that Kurt Angle when he debuted on on Impact Wrestling, he he, he usually it was originally quote Oh, it's true, it's true. But I really love this one. He's saying Oh, it's real, it's. Damn real! Yep. Oh, hold on. <coughs> yeah. <sighs> Alright, well. Anyway, and, um, yeah. 
And I like the way when they say the machine is crowned to be champ, that would be uh, Samoa Joe back in 2009. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, hell. Yeah. Yeah. Another greatest moment that, uh, East, that, um, that Bully Ray put Dixie Carter through a table last August. Oh, hell, I love that. <laughs> Yeah, Dixie Carter, that's what happens when you've gone when you've gone corrupt and abusing your power. That's what happens. So payback's a bitch. <laughs> Hail Bully Ray. And the best moments um, of TNA that they they did have Hall of Fames, like uh, first was Sting, then was Kurt Angle, and then there was Bully Bully Ray and Devon. The three of them are the three of them are um, are right now the TNA World Hall of Famers. So I wish I thought I wish it was AJ Styles because he's been there since the beginning. So yeah. So my big congratulations. Yeah. So congratulations to them and uh, yeah, that's the best Hall of Famers ever. So Sting, Kurt Angle, Bully Ray, and Devon. Yeah, these guys are the Hall of Famers of TNA. And that's not all. Um, that's, oh, and speaking of that, um, there was uh, the most important thing that, um, uh, the, besides the TNA riot that I witnessed, that it was back in uh, August of 2009, and oh man, all oh, hell was breaking loose, and I did witness the riot. <laughs> And that was so fun. Yeah, it was a lot of disagreements. Um, yeah, anybody doesn't know about the TNA Impact Wrestling Riot? It was the TNA Riot 2009. Uh, Google that one. You'll find out. And uh, you, you might find me in, uh, in somewhere in uh, somewhere in the uh, entrance side in the front row where the wrestlers entrance. But I'll never forget that. <laughs> Man, that was the best damn moment ever. And that's not all. Um, yeah, hold on. I already said that. I already said that. Um, yeah, I already said that. Okay, I already said that. I already said that. That's not all. The biggest moment uh, was uh, ECW, led by Tommy Dreamer, Raven, Stevie Richards, the Monk, and, and of course the return of Mick Foley. They they invaded uh, they invaded TNA back in the summer of 2010. And that was the second time I had a picture with uh, with uh, Tommy Dreamer because um, I, I first time had a picture with Tommy Dreamer was back in the spring of 2009 when uh, when uh, WWE SmackDown was in Las Cruces it was in Las Cruces and um, that's where I first uh, had a picture with Rey Mysterio and and Tommy Dreamer as well and and since then since I had a second time with Tron and the second time with Tommy Dreamer back. In the summer of 2010, that's when the uh, ECW invaded uh, TNA. That was a day of Slam Aversary. That was a day of uh, TNA Slam Aversary, and um, it was nice. Uh, and it, that's where uh, it changed. That's where it says Hard Justice now became Hardcore Justice, and that's where uh, ECW had their had their TNA had their uh, TNA Impact Wrestling uh, pay per view event, and it was great, man. I uh, really, it, it was so nice having. Uh, DCW invading TNA and uh, Tommy Dreamer's still the man, so good luck to you, man. All right, that was the best. But the most important thing I really like on team, on Impact Wrestling, the greatest moments, was the arrival of Hulk Hogan. It was back in January 2010, and I will never forget that one. So yeah, so yeah, Hulk Hogan made his debut on Impact Wrestling. Um, yeah, and um, <laughs> and I was yeah, and I was there um, witnessing his arrival to TNA. So and it was very nice. So I wish I had a picture with him, but um, <laughs> yeah. And I remember the last time he was on TNA was uh, last year of October that he that where he ended his contract. So um, and he made his return to to WWE um, to WrestleMania last uh, April. So. But I'll never forget the Hulkamania. So, what he's still running wild, and what he's gonna do for Christmas, brother? Well, I got a question for Hulk Hogan. What you gonna do for Christmas, brother? <laughs> yeah. But these are my greatest TNA moments. But the um, the most important TNA uh, greatest moments I know was um, 
I remember uh, posting that on Twitter uh, and especially on Facebook saying uh, the greatest moment was that SoCal Val was the best TNA knockout slash ring girl and that's what I said and um, I hope SoCal Val reads this one so and yeah yeah she, you know, she was also a good friend of mine as well so yeah well she's now in Shine Wrestling she's now in Shine Wrestling so so, I hope she's watching this, and um, so, Merry Christmas, so Cal Val, so, and sorry I was and I'm sorry if Florida was canceled, I wish I'd see you, so, take care, Mike, so, hopefully I'll see you again, my friend, so don't worry, okay, and those are my greatest TNA moments, if I could think, if there's something else I'm missing, uh, I'll let you know on the next uh, Impact on the next Dan the Man's Weekly, so that's my greatest moment. Okay. Alright. <laughs> Sorry it's so damn long. Now it's up to the Dirty River Boys, Nino, CJ, Travis, and, and Marco. They are back tonight at Tricky Falls, so I cannot wait to see them. So, and uh, I, I heard, I, res I just, um, I just heard the new album uh, that was released last October. And it was it was magnificent, man. You, uh, for those of you Dirty River Boys fans out there, please uh, get that CD. You're gonna like it, okay? So, yeah. And those of you who haven't heard of the Dirty River Boys, they're the folk band based on my hometown. And these guys are great, man. You guys gotta check it out, okay? So, oh, okay. All right, guys. And. Um, Alright guys, I'm about to wrap everything up, so tonight, can't wait to see the Dirty River Boys, and um, I'm about to, I'm about to, finish, and I still got a lot of Christmas cards to do, so, um, yeah, it's going to be a busy weekend, because we're about less than six days away till Christmas, so, alright you guys, so, and just a heads up, we'll do the best of uh, 2014 uh, after Christmas. Okay, so I'm gonna write down the lo I'm gonna write down the list of everything. So I'll keep you posted. All right, guys. Uh, before I go, um, my old friend Thomas Latterman. Um, there's another engagement. There's another engagement couple. So my old friend Thomas Latterman. Uh, she just got engaged to her girlfriend Crystal Pe Crystal Peebles. So. Uh, Thomas, congratulations, my friend, and uh, I wish you and Crystal the best. So I'm very happy for you. Congratulations, my friend, and uh, happy birthday to um, now Jihad Siavon of the lead singer Glenwood. Happy birthday, Meredith Nauman. I miss you. Happy birthday, uh, Stephanie Winkle. Happy birthday, uh, Crystal Molina. Happy birthday on tomorrow, D Lane. Elaine Briscoe, happy birthday tomorrow. Tell tell Philip hello. And uh, hey Mark, uh, I know it's early, man. I apologize about that, but happy birthday, Wolfpack forever, man. So and um, we all we always have Sting in our side, man. So woo! Sting power, my friend. Again, happy birthday. I wish I was in Florida celebrating your birthday. My old friend Sam Treble, happy birthday. And uh, Jesse Whitaker, happy birthday. And Brittany Temple, happy birthday over the weekend. So, And most importantly, two of my old friends, two of my good friends I know. Hey, Bobby Pippen, I uh, miss you, man. Happy birthday. Give my best to tell Brandy hello for me. I know Brandy's also, um, I know Brandy's birthday's coming up, so I'll tell her happy birthday for me. And my old friend, uh, Mary Beth, um, Mary Beth Dallas, um, happy birthday, Mary Beth. Give my best to, give my best to Blake. Tell Drifton hello for me, and, um, yeah, so, um, and happy birthday. So happy birthday, Mary Beth. So and, and um, yeah. So all right, you guys. I guess that's it. All right, guys. You guys have any questions on what I just said right uh, about TNA's greatest moments or UTEP football or the Dirty River Boys or anything else? Whatever you guys want, um, you know what to do. Just follow me on Twitter. Uh, message me on Facebook. Uh, don't forget to subscribe me on YouTube. Okay. All right, you guys, so um, I voted to get out of here before Santa catches me. Oh, wait, what, what happened to Santa? Oh, yeah, I guess Santa's still there. <laughs> All right, you guys. Okay, guys, so I better get the hell out of here. So, uh, so
so I gotta finish up. I gotta finish up some errands. I gotta finish up some shopping stuff. So. All right, guys. I'll see you guys later. Until then, this is Dan the Man Tennessee signing out. La 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 la. la.